An airplane flies from town P on a bearing of 45 degrees to another town Q, a distance of 200 km away. It then changes its course and flies to another town R on a bearing of 120 degrees. If R is directly east of P, we are asked to calculate the distance between P down to R correct to the nearest kilometer. Okay, let us make a rough sketch of this one. Um, you should know that the plane started from what? Town P. So let us assume we have a town P right here. Let me call this P. It travels to another town Q on a bearing of what? 4 to 5 degrees. So let us assume it is somewhere here. This is town Q. Distance is 200 kilometer apart, right? And the angle here is 4 to 5 degrees. And from Q, the plane travels to another town R on a bearing of 120 degrees. And according to the question, town R is directly east of P. So where is east of P? This is east of P, this parallel line. Heading to what? Town R. So let's connect this point to this point. So according to this question, this particular angle is 120 degrees. We are asked to find the distance from P down to R. All right. You should remember that angle on a straight line is 180. Already we have 120 here, which implies that we have 60 degrees here. And this particular angle right here is equal to this one because they are alternate angles. So this is 4 to 5. And if you join the two together, 60 and 4 to 5, you have 105 degrees. And because from north to east is 90 degrees, it implies that this particular angle must be 4 to 5 degrees because 4 to 5, 4 to 5 is 90. Then we need this particular angle again. You should know that the sum of all the three angles in a triangle equal to 180. So to find this particular angle, you can take away this and this from 180. And if you do that, you are going to get 30 degrees. All right, we need to find this side length. Let me call it X. By using sine rule, we have X. That is the side we are looking for. Divide by the sine of that angle opposite to it, which is 105 then this must be equal to, uh, since we have the side length, we can use it. We have 200 divided by sine of 30. And from here, we can cross multiply. We have x to be equal to 200 multiplied by sine of 105 divided by sine of 30 degrees. So let me use my calculator and press everything. x is equal to 386 because they say to the nearest kilometer so we have 386 kilometer which is option b